How are you? Happy New Year! Welcome to a new vlog, guys. How are you doing? Um, this is just me wishing you, you know, a huge compliment of the season, and also use the opportunity to show you guys my beautiful flowers from Purple Petals per usual. This one is really, really special because obviously it was sent with something really big i don't know what it's inside it came in two days ago or was it yesterday but i've had no time to you know i've had no time to look at them but yeah get into the flowers we have purple we have yellow we have white we've got these ones when they came these ones had not bloomed properly yet but look at it's not really open and I can't wait to put it in the vase. I'm going to be doing that later this evening. And of course, I'm wearing my PJs from K Casa. This, I would say, is my second favorite. I kind of really, really, really dig the white. But at the same time, I really love this. I like this fabric. It's a bit lighter. The length is lengthy. It's really long. So... I would say if you are going to get any one at all, get this one, okay? Get this one, get this one, get this one. And the white, I really love the white. What's crazy is that the white is same with the blue, with the black, right? But I really did just love the white. It felt different. So I don't know if it's because of the color, because you guys know I like, you know, I like white as a color. So yeah, um, I feel very, very comfy. And of course, I got a new cup for myself and this one is called so peachy so yeah it's a very beautiful color nobody has bought this color yet because i think you know they are just carried away with other colors but i can't wait for the first person that will order this because the person is going to love their cup so anyway without further ado let's see what's inside my christmas box from purple petals this is very heavy very beautiful this bow here, I kind of feel like I have not taken like proper pictures of them. Maybe I should do that now before I open it up. So yes, let me do that. I'll see you guys later. Okay, so I just took something cute. Um, let's put this aside. And let me open this. So yeah, I'm just going to face it here. I don't know how to open it, but... And I guess this is uh huh. I need to take this off first. I don't want to ruin this packaging. I really love it. I really love this. Oh, my God. I can't believe I'm untying it, guys. It doesn't feel right. It doesn't feel right. But yeah, look. I'm going to keep this. When I'm creating like a false bouquet, I will figure out how to. And it's going to come in handy next Christmas. So, so yeah. Let's get into it. Guys, wait. I'm going to make a video with my phone so that you guys can... I'm going to show you guys everything that's inside here, but first of all, look at what it looks like. <laughs> I'm already loving what I have here. Yeah, so I have a card. Let me save the card because I kind of feel like you guys are going to be a bit impatient. So we have this um, chocolate brownie biscuits from Cartwright. 
So I have cookies and my god look this is also oh luxury gold tea nice from m and s mm. i'm trying to open it but you know so this is tea i really love the packaging it's so beautiful then you know if i'm going to be taking tea it means i would need a teacup in it This is giving luxury. Look at it. It's gold. I mean, it has this very cute teaspoon that is also gold. I really love this. This means so much to me. Thank you so much, Purple Petals. Oh my God. What is this? So this is like a soap dispenser or something, but look at the packaging oh my god this is so beautiful this is so so beautiful thank you so much this is so beautiful <gasps> there's more <gasps> we have red we have wine non-alcoholic red grape juice cocktail if you know you know that i'm not really a fan of alcohol so this is really perfect because i will be drinking this particular one so much it looks so good thank you <laughs> thank you i'm saving these straw blankets for the last then we have this chocolate nice let me dig around and see because so many so many germs are hidden under this thing okay i guess we are done i guess we are done and this is the last one. Guys, it's so soft. This, this is like a true blanket you can use on your couches, you can use on your bed. This is just, you know, a reminder to go follow this page. This is like the perfect way to gift somebody at any season because you, I mean, Christmas is not the only season you should be gifting people things. And so imagine sending something like this to someone you love, the true blankets, especially those of you in distant relationships. You need to send things that will replace you a bit. Nothing will replace you 100%, but things that can keep your partners warm, like a cute teddy bear, like this blanket, you know, with your perfume so that they can always smell you. Thank me later for the tip okay send your fragrance your own fragrance maybe a mini size buy them their favorite perfumes send them a teddy bear send them something like this accompanied with other gifts purple petals got you covered okay so that your partner will always feel your presence even though you're far away when they miss you they'll just hug this blanket you know cover themselves or hug the teddy bear you're sending to them okay so yeah and always send them flowers Flowers are so important. Send money too, but flowers. And these people can also send money for you. Do you get? So send them flowers, send them money. You know, let your loved ones know you have them in mind. Okay? So yes, thank you again, Papa Petals, for always showering your girl with so much love, so much gifts. And yeah, this is the card it came with. Happy holidays and... Of course, here's to a season of warmth, love, happiness, and the simple pleasures that make this time of the year truly special. Season greetings to Amarachi. Thank you so much. Okay, guys, so um, what am I going to do next? Well, I'm thinking of packing a few orders, but I'll probably just leave that for tomorrow, guys. I'll leave that for tomorrow because... Even if I pack it today, I can't still deliver tomorrow. There's there's really no point for that. So yeah, um I'm going to be putting this in the face later in the evening. So yes, that's probably what we're going to be doing. So yeah, I'm gonna see you guys later.
among these friends I've always known. No, not ever, never, ever. Will you come home again? the second of um january 2024 hi 2024 um yes um today's my friend's wedding <laughs> i am currently at my designer's place to pick up my dress guys the story is long the story is long but yeah they're making my dress right now and hopefully i'll be done then i'll drive myself to the airport pack my car there and catch my flight because my flight is for 7 a.m this morning so yes that's that's basically what's happening that's basically what's happening the vlog is coming up today which i'm really excited for god there are mosquitoes everywhere here god anyway um yeah i'm just waiting for them to be done and i'll test it and they will make a few adjustments and i'll be off the time is currently 4 a.m. to 4. I don't think it's 4 a.m. yet, but yeah, I'm almost done. I'm just excited to be going. I mean, I'm going to Emo State, by the way. I'm going um, today, and I'll be back tomorrow. I'll be back the next day, so yeah. That's about it. Bye, guys. Ever, will you come home again? Hey guys so i just got to the airport i am leaving right now because i need to go check in but yeah i was able to drive myself i'm so excited we start rushing back bye guys hey boo i got i got a makeup artist okay, okay, okay. yes yeah, so she can go and do meme's own Hey guys, um, it's been a very chaotic morning and of course, because it was too chaotic, I couldn't carry you guys along with me, but you guys know that my dress was made in less than 24 hours. I had to drive to her office the midnight, you know, she finished my dress. Of course, it was not completely finished because they didn't have time to do the beading. I my driver disappointed me so I had to drive myself to the airport something I never thought I could ever do I drove myself to the airport I parked my car I'm going to be going back tomorrow so yeah my car is safe that one I know for a fact hopefully let me not trust Nigeria like that but yeah um my car is safe um I'm just I just think I just need to pay like about 15 to 10 um, 5 to 10 K I'm not sure I think it depends on the hours your car stays there Let's make sure the
you guys i just got back home sorry i just got back to the hotel um let me show you guys what i wore out um, just never had time to you know show you guys i took heels but at the end of the day we didn't wear heels so i wore my slippers but yeah um that's really it i need to take off this makeup i'm not sure i'm going to sleep because i feel like if i sleep i'm going to miss my flight or i could literally just you know shower pack my things you know set out what i need to wear tomorrow then set an alarm so that i can leave here and i also need to tell the hotel i need a cab i think that's what i'm going to do so that tomorrow to take me straight to the airport but yeah um sorry today to take me straight to the airport anyway um just thought to come here and tell you guys good night Hey guys, hi, good morning. I'm off to the airport, so thankfully, I say thankfully for a reason. Thankfully, my flight was um, moved because I set my alarm for 6 5, I think 5 5 30, 6 6 30, 7 7 30. I can't remember when I went to bed, but mm -hmm. I just showered. Did you get? Did everything I needed to do, packed my bag so that I'll just be off in the morning since my flight is quite early. Before I went to bed anyway, my the girl that usually helps me book my ticket, my agent, she reached out to me to tell me that they moved my flight. I was like, okay, that's fine. Since it's now 12 o'clock, it's okay. So I left my alarm. I still forgot to, you know, change my alarm. Guys, would you believe? That even though I set that alarm, none of it woke me. Sorry, my boat guy is calling me. The alarm didn't wake me at all. I woke up, I think, by past 8 or was it 9 o'clock. So if that flight was that time, I would have actually missed it. Because even my alarm could not wake me. think my boat is here I'm so happy I'm out of here I was supposed to stay back um, I was supposed to go for a house opening here in Emo State but guys I have quite a number of things to do I'm going to let you guys know about that later so I need to rush back because I'm actually needed anyway oops it would have been nice to, you know, attend the house with me, but I'm trying to, I'm trying to do other things that will benefit my life right now. Hey guys, so I'm downstairs. I went outside the hotel just to realize that the driver isn't actually in my hotel. I kind of feel like he wasn't looking at the map because I kept on saying you're in golden to leave, you're in golden to leave. He was like, yes, just want me to go downstairs and find out that he wasn't even in my hotel. He was probably in a very close um, hotel, but he didn't even look at the mail. And he didn't even follow his map, which is so weird. Anyway, um, thank God I'm not really in a rush, but I need to actually leave here. And I pray they don't move this flight again. I honestly pray they don't move the flight again. Mm. Outside my window is everything pale and cold can't seem to pick up my phone it's been ringing all day long guys we are back we are back we are back we are back and i'm about to start driving all the way to my house oh five five plus five five that's eleven okay not bad <sighs> Guys, it was the most stressful trip ever hmm. over an airport. Hey, guys, we were trying to check in. It took us two hours. Like, I was literally on a queue for two hours. Guys, it was a whole mess. It was a whole mess today. 
people fought there was this man that was ready to beat a woman <laughs> it was bad and obviously like in situations like that i don't know how to raise my phone guys it just felt a bit too intrusive like i wouldn't want anybody videoing me if they, if i'm fighting outside so it was a, these people this side the people in dana they were fighting um i used united there were about two people that fought there another set of people it was so chaotic guys it was so chaotic but anyway um the flight was great i sat close to this very cool dude so we were just chatting throughout the flight so that was that was that was that was a you know a relief at the end of the day so now i'm back to lagos i'm actually happy to be back guys i'm ha actually happy to be back i need to get my shit together because it's a new year so um the earlier i get out of this place the better for me wait to hmm. wait to wait, 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 wait. where's that paper they gave me god i beg i'm so clumsy eh? guys i can be so careless sometimes Let me just make sure i have it if I get to the entrance and start looking for it like a mad girl. Okay, I have it. I have it. So I paid 10,000 naira to, um, you know, get my car packed. I feel like if I came earlier in the morning, if my flight was still for 8.45, I would have paid 5,000 because that was what the lady told me. The lady told me if it's just 24 hours, I would pay, um, I would pay this thing 5,000 but it's obviously more than 24 hours 24 hours and a couple of extra hours so yeah um this is where we are this is where we are I'm going home now never been so happy I don't even know why I'm happy I think I'm happy at you know the experience you know me driving myself to the airport and driving myself back there's just something it feels first of all it's not giving soft life but it just feels you know i got my shit together i don't need anybody but i need somebody because i don't want to be doing this kind of rubbish i don't want to be doing this kind of you know it's so stressful it's so stressful guys so stressful but yeah julia is driving home from the airport ah my window we're going down let me show you guys <laughs> i don't even know whether you guys have seen it but let me just show you guys what's happening yeah we are going i hate this so like it's it's quite whatever but you guys get the juice yeah? but yeah this is what we are doing Ooh. <laughs> Okay, bye guys. I need to start driving. <laughs> hey guys, how are you? Today is Saturday and we have a wedding to attend. So I am currently doing my makeup because the wedding starts at 2 and the time is 2. Um, yeah, in my defense, Ijoma is the one. Ijoma is the reason we are starting to do our makeup by this time. So... We're actually attending um, her school daughter's wedding, so um, yeah. I also know the girl. Like we went to the same high school, but she's closer to Ijoma. She's closer to Ijoma, cause yeah, like I said, Ijoma was her school mother. I can't even believe Ijoma was having school daughters because Ijoma was really tiny in school. So it's like, how are you somebody's school mother when you look like a daughter? She was really, really tiny in school. She's still tiny now, but she was so tiny, so, so tiny in secondary school. So imagine a tiny person having school daughters. And she had more than one, like... <laughs> she had more than one, like, what are you doing? You need a mother more than you need to be a mom, okay? Anyway, um, I nearly didn't go. I actually promised the girl I was coming. Like I, you know, told her I was coming, but I nearly didn't go because I didn't feel like I was prepared. I didn't feel like I had clothes for it. But you know, 
know that thing about always saying you don't have clothes is because you've not entered your wardrobe to go and check what you have. So yesterday, when Ijoma blackmailed me or manipulated me or something, tried to make me feel bad, I had to go into my wardrobe to look for, you know, something. And of course, there was something there for me to wear. And I haven't worn it since the last time I wore it. I think I went to Zanzibar two years ago and I haven't worn it since then. How time fucking flies. Zanzibar was two years ago. It was last year. No. Last year was last year was the Europe tour. <laughs> no, it's fine. Last year was the Europe tour. Yeah. It's two years ago. My life. <laughs> Girl. Two freaking years ago was when I went to Zanzibar. So I haven't worn that dress since that time. So this just feels like the perfect time to, you know, attend the wedding. Blessing, I love you feel like you should please help me and get that fan in, in if Naya's room too. Let her on AC. Okay. Bring the fan in this person's room. The usual thing I would do if I'm going for a wedding is to call a makeup artist. But guys, have you heard home services like almost 100k? Have you heard it? Have you heard it? 100,000 naira. So, I remember that I am a fine girl and I can actually do my own makeup. It will not be makeup artist worthy but it still complements my face you know i'll still be a fine girl at the end of the day but you see what we're going to do how do you see jama's phone and charge it there anyway let me <laughs> finish up my makeup some of you in fact not some of you one person here complained that i'm always talking too much <laughs> not like i care the person was angry because i didn't show them my offense salad like how can you be mad at me that i didn't show you offense salad but i show you every other thing but that particular offense salad i didn't show you you're angry with me because of it Stop doing such. It's wrong. So anyway, the person said I talk too much. So let me go and finish my makeup and take you guys for the wedding. Inugo, bye. I don't know why you get through the makeup. Eh? I don't want to show them the makeup. I show them makeup process. When I've not yet gone to go and learn makeup, I beg you, Joma, if you want to insult me, start with no, idiots. I want to. Okay, you know what I told them about it. No, I'm, yeah, I'm just letting them know that I'm getting ready. <laughs> Behind these clothes, I know the sun will be Today's raining, so be patient with me. I'll be right somehow. I must be somewhere the sky is blue. I'm too tired to sleep, too tired to do anything else and doing nothing. I'm too. Already she Hi, Sonny. Hi. So her dress is from Fashion Nova. My dress is from Bloom on IG. Um, the it's a floral themed wedding. So yeah, wearing these earrings from Chica Erand Lux. Love it. And yeah, we're just looking cute. I just thought to come and say hi to you guys. And of course, I'm gonna carry you guys along with me. Yeah. See you guys later. Bye. Bye. <laughs>
guys um today was fun a good time was hard for sure i'm so happy i was able to make it to the wedding guys i was this close to not going i hope my dad does not see this i was this close because I, I was so tired i slept really really late last night so i think i slept like five o'clock in the morning 5 a.m so guys i was really really tired i had already told the drama to go but but um a night before i had removed my clothes we had iron our clothes so i was like you know what i mean since the wedding is by two then i should be able to make it but yeah i'm so happy um i made it it was fun food kept on coming guys there was a bacha there was a bacha and that was so thoughtful of the bride and the groom because what is a wedding without a bacha? What is a wedding without a bacha? There was a bacha. I was so happy. Um, food. There was food everywhere. I met some of you. <laughs> I'm so shy. I met some of you. And you guys were sweet enough to even approach me. Thank you. Hi, girlies. Hi. Um, yeah, it was so nice seeing you guys. It was so nice seeing everybody. Um, fun fact. I think I already mentioned it. Pamela was Ijoma's school mom, so, and I saw um, a couple of my high school, you know, friends. It was really nice. It was really nice to go. Yes, yeah, so, anyway, I need to, oh, I wanted to say I need to wash up, but no, I actually need to shoot two contents this night. So, now that I have my makeup on, I'm just going to use it once and for all and yeah and after that i'm going to be going back to bed so yeah i just thought to let you guys know that i am back from the party talk to you guys later mm -hmm. here mm -hmm. yeah because i'm actually in the middle mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> there has to be another pose like i'm thinking should i hold the water on this hand what you explained to me is perfectly okay. Yeah, but like, what what if when I wear the dress, like the angle is not I'm giving? Hey guys, so um, 
I'm currently shooting for a brand. I've already shot for this brand like twice, but I didn't really like the videos. I'm kind of, I don't want to call myself a perfectionist, but, but if it doesn't come out the way I envision it, I'm most likely not going to release it. And I have the, um, I would say, yeah, I'm able to deliver when I can because it's PR. It's not paid. But I usually don't take this long even if it's PR because this has been with me for like one month plus. That was not my intention. A lot's been happening. Um, you know, I'm always really busy with work during the festive period. So I honestly did not have the time to shoot it, you know, back to back. But yeah, um, I'm hoping this particular one clicks and I would send it to her. If it clicks, I'll send it to her tomorrow or next tomorrow. Hey, I did not get to see it. Okay guys, so this is the feet. No, 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 don't no, move the camera. I'm not moving it, Daddy. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay guys, so this is the feet. This is the feet. Um, the dress is very pretty. Pairing it with this purse I took from each your man. All these accessories are as, because... Why did I say as? Has. Jeez. Has. Um... Even this one is, you know, it belongs to her. Because I, I don't have a lot of silver dress, so, yeah. So I'm, but the shoes are mine, though. Shoes are so cute. Um, I'm going to start shooting the other part, okay? Let's see if I get I've been hanging on, counting days, thinking it was me all along. Had a million conversations in my head about where it went wrong. And I've got no idea where you've been, who you are, not anymore All I got is this Polaroid picture of us from June 24th It's where I kissed you for the first time, played on your sheets You gave me your heart and said you trusted with me But all I did was let you down time and time again It wasn't my intention, maybe we should have been friends that did her decor. Yes, they did really well. I love the shade. I love how minimal. Yes, yeah. I love how minimal the decor of the space yeah. was. We're actually talking about Ada's wedding. Um, I don't know why I keep calling her Ada, but her name is Ada I love or Pamela. But yeah, um, I just wore my jacket. I want us to do a souvenir haul because they gave us a lot of things. So let me show you guys. Um, and by the way, your girl caught the book. Hey. I was so shy, but I got the bouquet. So I'm here to tell you guys to, you know, get your, you know, I should be ready. Like, I'm going to give you guys colors very soon because 2024 is the year. Is the year you guys are going to help me. You guys are going to boogie it down. We are going to shake it to the altar. Okay? So, <laughs> let us start. Uh, this was the... No, 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 no. If, give me the bowls. Yeah. So this was the first thing they brought. I'm going to show you guys according to how it was given. This one was, this is what they gave me, us first. They gave me this, they gave Ijeoma this, which is kind of the opposite of our colors, like what we wore. It wasn't on purpose, but I wore green and they gave me this. And she wore pink and they gave her this, which is like, this is similar to my, this is similar to her clothes. But yeah, just showing you guys what they gave us. So we have a bowl to be washing, you know, things in the kitchen. Um, then the next bag that came was this bag. I haven't, was it this bag or this one? Which one did they bring? They they bring that one. This one I first, okay. Oh, yeah, 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 that's true. So, this was the next bag they gave. Look at Pamela and her hobby. So, inside here, we have a mug to be drinking the tea. <sighs> Yeah, the two of them. The inside is blue. The inside is blue. Keep it, keep it in the distance. 
and here we have a jota so this is courtesy of the umoru family so that is pamela and um, yeah so we have a jota here um so we have a jug and jota that's what we have in this bag then we got this one next and inside this one we have a mini towel if your mom didn't collect this one or they didn't come to her they kind of missed her she was talking so the woman thought she had given her the woman now passed her that's what that's what happens when you talk when you're talking when you're talking <laughs> you know gifts pass you so she did not get her well. <laughs> she didn't get her well. so yeah I have this one and she doesn't you should, you then pray the last <laughs> then the last but not the least this is so cute the bag is so so cute together forever in love pamela and kenetchuku yeah courtesy i don't know the name evody evody courtesy evody um let's see what's inside <laughs> okay so we have another mini jota with their pictures this is pictures from her civil wedding very cute i really love what she wore she played with pearls on her um cuts or her civil wedding and i really loved it um yes yeah, so a mini jota and we have a mini water bottle american love carry it Anywhere you want to go, anywhere you want to eh, eh. love it, you know. That's basically it, guys. That's basically it. I'm going to go and you know get myself ready to start shooting. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys what I got on the wedding. See you guys later. Notice that they gave me a mug and they gave Ijoma a plate. Oh my god, your plate. Juma, please take my mug. No, this one looks like the shell. Like shell. Juma, please. No. If you don't give me, you can't come here anymore. Like, I have a key, girl. So, what are you talking you about? You have a what? You have a key. I, have a I will key. change the locks. <laughs> you guys should tell Juma to give me these plates, or else you will not be seeing her here. I saw this. I will blind you. you guys she said son is i will blind your son as in they will blind me <laughs> but Joma, how do we know which one belongs to you and which one belongs to me because how do we know me, whether know. this is not mine and this isn't hers no and they come to yours together because but Joma, i think it's fair i take this place because i, I love the water and you don't i don't care she doesn't like the beach I wonder if my see me would. This is like a shell. I took you to the it's wedding. It's talking to me. You took me to the wedding. So how about you give me my No, I since you took me to the wedding, carry the towel that no. you did not that you did not stand in line for. I don't want to. Carry everything since you took me to the I wedding. No, no, I'm saying that you should give it to me because you're supposed to give me that and the towel because Hey, are you not wicked like this? No, son is. I might be wicked. Guys, I'm being jealous. I want us right to both have a touch of blue, so you give me this plate to take the towel. Oh. Yeah, I should I should take the plates and give you towel. Give me the plates so it is so Why don't you want to take towel and give me plates? I have towels. We should have a touch of blue. Is this or I take this blue? No. Should we do timbon timbo? No. Let's see. I never mean those. She's not. She's she's not being fair. Oh my god. But yeah, this is her plate. So so cute. So cute. I really love it. I wish I got this one, but it's fine. I'm gonna take my mug. Anyway, um, that's basically it, guys. See you guys later. Hey guys, good morning. I am in a rush, so let's go pack my client's orders. Um, yeah, I'm currently shooting a video, so I have my camera here. Let me start right now. Wake up to PM. I don't know where we are. Looks like a cheap motel with her clothes on the floor.
chasing you like the tail of a dog I don't get no sleep when we kiss in the dark like we do I just love the way it feels Yeah, I know it's bad but I can't resist When I look in your eyes I don't know what is real All I know is that Tomorrow I'll be leaving the house because I have work. Here is a mess, so I need to take it off. Hi guys, how are you doing? Um, today is Tuesday. Work has started. The last time I came here, I think we were packing orders together. Um, the delivery man just picked them up. I think an hour ago. I'm heading out. I'm going to drop my sister and blessing to um at the salon. My sister is going back to school, so she needs to get her hair drawn. She needs to look pretty. Um, after that, I'm going straight to work. After dropping her off, I'm going straight to work. I'm going to meet up with one of my clients. We have unfinished um, business from last year, so we need to sort everything out today. Anyway, um, I'm heading there now. If I have the time, I'll stop by the salon to wash my hair. If not, I'll just leave it for tomorrow because I need to fix my hair and get ready for the new week anyway um yeah hope you guys are okay hope you guys are good i just thought to come here and show my face see you guys later bye <laughs> 